Hello everyone and welcome to my Christmas decor sneak peek video and there's our tree in the background and we got a few other decorative things out right now that I'm excited to share. I'm not going to show everything today but I want to show a couple things that I've been working on so that you guys can get some inspiration since it's almost Thanksgiving and um, a lot of people decorate right after Thanksgiving. Tyler and I went for decorating a little early this year because um, number one we're moving in January because we're building a house. Yay! And second of all because we're super excited about this year being our first year married so it's our first Christmas as Mr. and Mrs. and we are fully anticipate on celebrating that to the fullest. <laughs> so without further ado, here we go. So first I want to show you guys our Christmas tree and we did a fluffy um, white tree skirt at the bottom. And then you can see that's our topper. Our tree is all in gold, rose gold, and um, champagne. We added in a few of these guys because we really liked that color. But for the most part, we just kept it all that and we added in white with the white fur and a few white ornaments. See, we already have some gifts. I already started wrapping Tyler's gifts, so he's got a few down there already. I wanted to show it to you with the lights off so that you guys could really see the colors. I'll zoom in. We have some really special ornaments. We really tried to do a variety of sizes. So these ones are much bigger. And we also did a bunch of different types of ornaments. Um, so a lot of them have shapes and sparkles and some are matte finished. And so right here. Um, I just love this little champagne colored cross and we have little trees and snowflakes tucked back in the back You can see them and then we have little ice skates and I love these Ornaments they look like glass. They're not glass. I have no glass ornaments on this tree except this one might be glass My cousin got this for us for our engagement If you guys seen the engagement video that Tyler made for me, then you'll know exactly what that is about <laughs> Um, and how the Starbucks cup got involved and how he wrote on it to ask me to both be his girlfriend and to marry him and it made its way into the video. So this is our tree. We threw in some special ornaments. This one is from last year and every year my family has a tradition of making ornaments at Thanksgiving for the Christmas tree. And on we tried to make an Olaf one, me and Tyler made this together and then there's our names on the back. So I thought that was really cute. And then we have this little guy that we got this year. First Christmas. And then this is one of my favorites. I got that last year. As well as this one, which I love. It's just a big ring. And it looks kind of like my ring because I have a solitaire. <laughs> so I just love how our tree turned out. It, literally, this is my dream tree as far as the color scheme, the flocking everything we even have some cool ornaments like this big antler which i thought was really neat um so basically this is everything i ever wanted in a tree and every time i come down i'm just like so amazed by like how beautiful it is and i love it every time i love we have like this little this a little champagne colored bird and a little silver bird cage which i thought was super cute so now i will light up the tree and show you guys how it looks all lit so there is our tree all lit and ready for Christmas, ready for me to wrap some more gifts. <laughs> do you like the tree, Sophie? Do you like the tree? You do, yes. <laughs> Sophie's very excited about it. <laughs> so that is our tree. All of the ornaments on this tree came from Hobby Lobby or at home. And then of course I have some special ones which have been personalized and things like that. Um, our topper came from Big Lots. They have some really cute stuff this year. All of the um, ribbon that we have going down, including the faux fur ribbon, we got that from Hobby Lobby. And these picks, which are so, so pretty and just twinkle in the light, um, we got those from Hobby Lobby as well. The next area that I wanted to share is right here on my coffee table. I have this tree that I got from 
um, Big Lots. It's all in gold and rose gold. And then I have this really cute um, candle called Snow Day. I got it from Aldi's, actually, surprisingly. And um, it is just, it smells so good. And they were such a good price. So I highly recommend those for Christmas gifts. But I'll probably include that in a later video that I'm going to do about Christmas gifts. And then the little uh, reindeer I got from Hobby Lobby. He has champagne too and matches the tree. And it's on my favorite Marvel tray, of course. And so there is a look at that. The next thing I wanted to show you guys is this little side table that I have over here. And I put a couple different things on it. The big fluffy tree is from um, Hobby Lobby. The reindeer is from Big Lots. And this cute little um, picture that says I love you more is actually from TJ Maxx. And then I just have some photo albums down there because I love photo albums. And I tend to keep a lot of them around. So that's our little corner by our couch. So now I'll show you guys our front area um, where we have um, our little stockings are hung up there. And we have our little TV stand, our blanket box. And then I'll zoom in over here. We did a little nativity. I got this cute sign from Target. And there's one of our, there's our fall album that I made on Snapfish. And then this is the little sparkly pine cones. I got these from um, Aldi and just stuck them in a little, <laughs> little um, hearth and hand basket. So I thought those were super cute. And then right over here, I got these little, um, really, really, really cute little nutcrackers. And Tyler told me that I could only get them if the mouth actually worked. So they do work. <laughs> So I thought this was super, super cute what we strung down here. This is from Hobby Lobby and I like how it has little pearls mixed in along with um, little sparkly um, little balls and little fluffy tool balls as well. Got another nutcracker over here just hanging out. And then these are our stockings which I hung on the stairs because that seemed to be the best place. Um, but I got my stocking and Sophie, our dog stocking, of course, <laughs> from TJ Maxx. Tyler's stocking was from Hobby Lobby. And you can see Tyler's already got a little special surprise in there, but I wrapped it up so he would not be peeking. So for Vlogmas, the videos I'm planning on doing in December, I plan on talking a lot about stocking stuffers. These cute little letters, I got these from at home. Tyler doesn't have one because he's the only boy, so obviously we know his is his. <laughs> this is my wreath that I made and I'm so excited about it. Um, I made this all by myself. The outside part of the wreath, the actual main part of the wreath with the sparkly parts and the green and the pine cones, I actually got those at a yard sale um, in like fall I think, like early fall. And then what I did to change things up a little bit was I got all these fun little picks and things from Hobby Lobby and I just kind of stuck them in there and then I tied this big rose gold bow to go on top and I am so excited to put this up on my door in just a couple days. So it is going to be super super pretty and I cannot wait. I'm so excited with how it turned out and it matches the tree super well. So I'm really excited about that. The last thing I want to share with you guys is a little hot cocoa bar that I made in my kitchen and I'm going to do probably a DIY on this because I got everything super cheap and I thought that this would be a really cool thing to um, show people how to make for themselves but I also added in a lot of things with copper, um, these cute little signs that I got from Hobby Lobby and just some cute little added things like this little box that I got from the Dollar Tree. Um, and I was able to make this really cute, simple little hot chocolate bar, um, which I thought was adorable and I've always wanted one, so this gave me an excuse to be able to make it for myself. Um, but I added in some candy canes and then I have the two things in the back. This one has marshmallows, that one has cocoa. Um, and so I just thought that that was really cute. So I even made a little thing for cinnamon and I thought that that would be really, really cute. So. Um, yeah, I thought I'll do another video sharing more on this later. 
So that was a little bit of a sneak peek of our decor for this year and we are so excited to share even more with you. As well as this year I will be doing Vlogmas which is one of my favorite vlogging things and it is basically where I'll do as many videos as I possibly can in the month of December um, that is Christmas related so we'll cover stocking stuffers and different recipes and other really cool things, some DIY decor and other things that I'm sure you guys will love. So I'm so excited that you watched this video with me. Do not forget to subscribe down below so that you can watch Vlogmas along with everybody else and we will have a super fun time. Also leave any suggestions in the comments down below so that I can make sure that I make a video that you will enjoy for Vlogmas. And I hope that you enjoy your Thanksgiving and that you enjoy um, all of this wonderful time of year. And I can't wait to see you guys next time. Bye!